Hey guys, part five, black. We kicked out Brian because he didn't know what was going on. That's exactly what happened. <laughs> sort of. <laughs> kind of. Anyway, this is the part that I clicked back to after looking at fucking Flowros. <laughs> and being like, why do you keep looking at that desk? It's not unusual. They keep saying there's nothing unusual. No, there were two different desks, both of which were not unusual. All right. Fine. See, there's this one here, and there was the one by the door we came in from. Yeah, all right. I see, too. Eh. The, is this supposed to be, like, a record room, or...? Uh... What? I, I mean, I could check the map, but I'm not going to. Because I'm what? not playing. Okay, what the... Is the article not important? You see, that's what I was wondering. <laughs> I think the implication is the important article is gone. Okay, because I was like, alright, let's, let's see the clipping. No, okay. <laughs> yeah, no, you don't deserve it. Oh no, I just realized. Ah, I'm going to have to re-edit one of these parts. Oh. Not the ones we're doing. They're like, I think it's like the second to last part. Yeah. There, uh, there are two, like, notes slash books. They don't always appear. Oh. I don't know why. One of them explains, uh, a, a drug. Well, we've walked, we kind of, sort of started unearthing that mystery at the police station. The optional police station. I may have missed the part about Yes, you were looking at, like, flowers. <laughs> okay, to be fair, right, he's hard to take this. your eyes off of. <laughs> you need this nondescript plastic bottle to get the good ending. Uh, in the kitchen? Yes, in the kitchen. What is with- okay, is that the emulator? Wait, what is it? Shit, when you camp, everything keeps getting wobbly. Oh, no, that's the game. The game is that, like, when things get to the edge, it gets wobbly. That's... Wait. What do you mean? Like, okay, look at this- okay, the schedule board isn't gonna work. The one in the kitchen was a better example. But the... Oh, I think I know what you mean. Yeah, that might have been in the emulator. Anyway, looks... someone broke this bottle. And it, it looks, looks like smashed it on, on purpose. purpose. How? Okay, CSI over here. <laughs> he writes books, Ariel. Oh, you're right. That means he knows <laughs> everything. So yeah, we scoop. You have to scoop up this liquid on the floor into the plastic bottle you picked up. Um. Because that makes sense. You figured that out on your own? You definitely could figure that out on your own. I, um, I'm very confused. How are you supposed to even identify it? You're not a goddamn chemist. I mean, he doesn't know what it is. It's just... Stop the noise! Eh, that noise seems fine. Probably. I don't agree with you. I don't think it's anything to worry about. Anyway, when we're here in the normal version of the hospital, there's a lot of emphasis on the basement. You know, for a normal hospital, it sure does have a lot of giant-ass cockroaches. I mean, I don't think there's people here anymore, Ariel. Then why was the doctor here? Uh, because he fell asleep and woke up and no one was here. So that's one of the things that gets a little weird with Silent Hill. Yeah, where are all the people in, that lived in Silent Hill? Because, like, if you're not... Unless there's actually three versions. The version you get trapped in, the other world, and then the one people actually live in. Yeah. Which, I mean, that's not impossible, know. since if you're in Silent Hill, there's a good chance you're trapped there for a reason. I mean, Harry's not. He's just... He's, He's trapped just there dead. trying to find his daughter. <laughs> I mean, Heather's not. Heather is trying to get revenge on the person who killed her father. <laughs> yeah, but she's not trapped. But she's also supposed to give birth to the cult god. Yes. So she's sort of oh, trapped. Oh, <laughs> I guess we can't go this way. Nothing around here. Let's go oh, to the well, third floor. Oh, well, okay, I, I guess. 
get in this wobbly elevator. I'm sure it passed inspection. <laughs> anyway, I guess we'll just try the third floor. I guess I just fucked up. Oh, I know what's gonna happen. Oh, that door's locked. Uh, I must have missed something down on the first floor. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. I know what it's gonna do. Alright, well, let's go back down to What's the first floor this? of the basement. Oh. <laughs> four! <laughs> Alright, to get it out of the way for anyone who doesn't know, four is, sounds a lot like the word death in Japanese. Alright, we've been through this. It's one pronunciation. They normally use yon. If you use she, it sounds like shini. Shini is death. Well, one of the words for death. That was weird. Where the fuck was Alessa? Uh, that was that was kind of weird, yeah. Where the fuck are we? <laughs> uh, well, we can't We're go back. We're stuck now, I guess. Oh, uh, everything's all. Hopefully, red. we find the stairs. <laughs> it's better for exercise, anyway. What the fuck. Yeah. Who's locking doors behind Dahlia? Stop Dahlia, that! Come on. <laughs> you and your barefoot ass. <laughs> well, she had to put shoes on. That's why it took her a while to catch up. <laughs> oh, good. We found the stairs. I was worried. Thank God. <laughs> Is it a cutscene? What if that or... was your Silent Hill? Just being trapped on a floor and not being able to leave? I mean, yeah, that's uh, that's pretty typical. <laughs> Oh. Oh, it's a nurse for real this time. Yeah, they don't have the stupid sexy nurses in this game. Nope, because it doesn't have the same connotation as the nurses in two. I mean, they have the stupid sexy nurses in Origins. Yeah, because they didn't get the points. <laughs> no. Konami told them to put it in there. Ugh. Also that. Because Konami didn't get the points. No, they, they just wanted all the things that they forced into the movies, into the games. These nurses but, sound particularly masculine. <laughs> Not that there's anything wrong with that, but just... Eh. <laughs> well, anyway, you might notice they have, like, a parasitic growth on their back. I mean, I noticed that they moved a little quicker than I was expecting. Oh no, they are very fast. They are... One of the most dangerous enemies in the game. Except for the sewer enemies, fuck those. Uh, so I guess we're Otherworld now. I'm no, not... no, Ariel, this is what it really looks like in the I'm, I'm hospital. not super sure when we switched. It was, Maybe uh, when it was very went... dark. <laughs> it was once we got to the fourth floor. Oh, well, I guess that's fair. Everyone Everything... knows that the fourth floor only exists in the Otherworld. Yes. So, there's this empty-ass bird cage, and in another room there was a steel plate screwed to a wall. Okay. Don't worry about it, we're not gonna deal with that in this run of the hospital. Oh. That's for nowhere. Oh. That's what it's called, it's nowhere. Um. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Who there? Who did that? I like to imagine that that sound was just you running into the wall. <laughs> Ow. He turns around. I'm oh, sorry if anyone heard that. He's like, who? Oh, it wasn't me. <laughs> oh, oh no, no, a second one. Anyway, so the oh, parasites on their back. Yeah. Uh, it's theorized that the reason for those is Alessa sees the, all the doctors and nurses as parasites that were feeding off of her own suffering. Uh, understandable. It's also why there are cockroaches here, because cockroaches are insect and kind of parasite-like, and they probably didn't want to make an actual parasite thing running around <laughs> as an enemy. Not yet. I mean, there's really not another parasite 
thing. I mean, I was more it. making a Resident Evil 4 joke, but... Oh, okay. <laughs> Actually, I think there is a parasite thing in 3 for, like, a boss fight. I don't remember 100%, though. Yeah, I, I don't know. I mean, it makes sense, considering how much these games tie into each other. Yeah, it would. I don't know why this room's here. It's a laundry room. There's nothing there. Well, they have to clean the linens. Although, actually, a lot of places use an external service to clean the linens. I know. That's, why, that's another reason why I was confused. <laughs> Alright, Jaws, calm down. <laughs> I so, almost... all these different plates are... They're supposed to tie into Alice in Wonderland. I saw a turtle and a cat. Yeah, there's one, uh, I think it's a hatter, and the other's a queen. Okay. I don't remember what the turtle is. Yeah, um, there's, if there's a turtle, I read Alice in Wonderland and was severely disappointed. Um, it wasn't nearly as earth-shattering imaginative as everyone made it sound like. Uh, I'm sure when it came out, it was. Eh. It was, like, after- oh. well, hang on, before I say that, let me check my release years. <laughs> oh. Oh. And year... 1865. Eh, it would've been- it still would've been after. Hmm. Nah. Ariel, you're gonna miss it. Uh. Oh. That's That's a thing. Probably fine. It's feeding off of blood like a parasite. Like that movie Parasites? What? There's probably more than one, so I don't know what you're talking about. Anyway, you need to sell <laughs> this blood pack and it's like a dog just looking at it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> that's that's fine. <laughs> I hate that thing, it's gross. Alright, so I'm gonna call bullshit on the Alice in Wonderland being imaginative for the time. That's um, fair. Because, one, it was 20 years oh. after, um,. Edgar Allan Poe, which you might say, that's not that that fanciful, but his stuff gets pretty weird sometimes. Uh, it's also uh, almost 50 years after, like, Dracula and Frankenstein. And uh, then there's, you know, the ancient epics, <laughs> which get really weird. <laughs> Four-leaf clover, violets in the garden, dandelions along a path. Unavoidable sleeping time. I would love unavoidable sleeping time. Ariel, it means death. I would love unavoidable <laughs> sleeping time. <laughs> I say again. <sighs> Wait, did I forget something? Oh no. I mean, maybe. There's an awful lot of locked doors. Yeah. Most of them are just jammed. It's very dark. It's a loading screen. I wish they would show you running like an idiot every loading screen. <laughs> no, it's only when you turn the game on. Ugh. Which we might maybe actually see one more time. Oh, you're a doctor. Yeah, no, they have normal doctors too. Uh. There's not as many, because... I mean, in general, there are more nurses in a hospital than actual doctors. I mean, that but... is kind of the point. Like, getting the RN is slightly easier than getting a doctor, uh, uh, an MD. Um, but at the I same mean, time, why are all the doctors men? Uh, in this game? Be, uh, they're, they're like that because it was easier to make that. 
I mean, one, yeah, it's easier. Two, what year was Alessa supposed to be doing things? Or is this supposed to be, like, real time? I think. Because I thought it was, like, the 60s. I don't think it's that. <laughs> but I also don't want to look it up. Because these also are not modern day or 90s nurse outfits. Yeah, no, they're not. They, they switched to scrubs a while ago. <laughs> Anyway, come to this vending machine, you get a shitload of healing items. Aw, oh, yeah. Mm. Oh. oh, it's just an empty ass room. Oh, that's just a window, it's not. Ah! ah! Well. That room becomes important later. Oh, okay. And we're in nowhere. Ugh. Okay, I want to see. I haven't seen one yet, but that's only because I just remembered to make the joke. If we what see. Are you looking for a, no uh, a nurse? No. A doctor? Waiting for one of those godforsaken chairs with wheels. No. <laughs> 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 I don't think. You know what? I don't think there's a single wheelchair in the hospital. What? <laughs> Which, you know... I, I think Harry... I think Harry's... Wondering why there's a wheelchair in the elementary school makes sense. They took them all and put them in the elementary school. Well, that's... And in that, and in that one alley. That means that everyone got healthy enough to leave at the same time. And they took oh. all the wheelchairs. But if you're healthy, why do you need the wheelchairs? I mean, you broke your leg. What do you want? <laughs> <laughs> Not everyone who oh, breaks Oh, by the way, the, the room where we find the pink liquid for the bottle, that's Dr. Kaufman's office. Oh. I wonder why he smashed that deliberately. Well, maybe he didn't. Maybe someone else did. Maybe it was a nurse! Uh, it was the cult. Oh. Maybe it was a... <laughs> it was a cult nurse. Maybe it was Dahlia again. Because I'm just Who gonna smashed see... this bottle? <laughs> Pyramid head. <laughs> I like to imagine that any, like, vague cult activity or the doors being locked, that they're all just Dahlia. <laughs> Is this the same? Tangent? She's just on the other side of the door banging on the piano. <laughs> yeah, just... Eh. And she got to the church really fast. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, it's time to solve this puzzle. I'm not gonna explain it. Um. It's kind of too long. But uh, you're basically just putting these in the order that they're listed on the... in the riddle. Oh. And it's written in a way where even if you don't really know, like, Alice in Wonderland, you can associate them via color. Yeah, I was gonna say, it didn't really seem to have anything to do with Alice in Wonderland. Just the uh, colors. The, the, the Hatter is supposed to be the Mad Hatter, the Queen. No, I mean the, the poem. Yeah, yeah, you mostly get that from these pieces. No. And a turtle. And a turtle. Not you know a what? caterpillar. I need to look this up. A turtle. <laughs> I know the part's over. I'm still looking it up. Alice in Wonderland. There's a turtle. I feel like it's a very minor side character. The Mock Turtle. Wait, hang on. The Mock Turtle is a fictional character devised by Lewis Carroll, 18th by book. Uh, its name is taken from a dish that was popular in the Victorian period, mock turtle soup. I mean, okay. they did that, but was it in Alice in Wonderland or through the Yes, it's a glass? character. It's a, it's a character in the book. But it was it in Alice in Wonderland or through the looking glass? No, it was in the Alice in Wonderland book. They're both Alice in Wonderland. <laughs> oh, I don't know. <sighs> It might be through the looking glass since no one knows who this turtle is. <laughs>